Uh, hey, yo, what's up? Wait, why is it so dark? Anyways, um, hey, yo, what's up, gamers? Welcome back to another video. It's me again, Bullets of Tower. Currently, I'm cold and tired and exhausted and freezing. I want to go to sleep, but I'm not going to go to sleep because guess what? I need to record a video and I, I desperately need to put a video up or else YouTube is just gonna, like, absolutely exterminate, uh, like, every, every, all of my progress on YouTube, or not my, or, you, 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 you if, if, if I may, if, if I do not post content, then YouTube is just gonna be like, oh, say bye byes to us promoting your video, so I, I, I need to make a video. Anyway, so I decided that I'm going to make a video on something that I've been kind of obsessed with this thing. I I love this thing. This thing, it's... I don't know what to name it. I don't exactly know what it is. It's, it's, it's a hedgehog plushie. And it's, it's, it has a unicorn horn and wings and it's rainbow, it's cute, it's, a, it's this, it's my favourite thing ever, practically. Um, and I love it so much. It brings me so much joy and I wanted to make a video on it. Um, my mother bought this for me. Um, was it last Saturday? Yeah, last Friday actually. Last Friday at the from the warehouse. Um, because I'm I've been getting very, very good grades. Um, it was it was fifteen dollars. Kind of expensive, but that's alright. You should, this thing it costs about how much my outfit usually costs. Well, actually, no, not really. Because, like, I thrift a lot of my clothes, right? I mean, my, it, basically everything except for my leather pants, because those are expensive. But, like, if, if we're just talking about, like, my shirts and my outer garments and my shoes, my shoes were ten bucks. How, how are my combat boots, like, five bucks cheaper than this thingy? That is confusing. Um, but this thing, it's really cute and adorable. And so, you see, basically what was happening was, like, we were about to leave the warehouse. But then I was just like, oh, mom, I want to look at the plushies. Can we look at the plushies, please? And she was just like, yes, of course, Tala. And so we went to look at the plushies. And I was looking through all of the ones, and I found this thing. And it was calling to me. And it, cause, and I looked at it and I was just like, oh my god, I legitimately need this. And as as once I had bought it, it I fell in love with it even more. Because it's literally everything. Because, you see, the, th the thing about me, if you didn't know this already, it's important to note that, like, if you put anything, like, pink, rainbow, sparkly, unicorn, hedgehog themed, just anything like that, in front of me, I'm going to be drawn to it. So this th this thing fits all of the criteria. Hedgehogs are one of my favorite animals. I love rainbows. I love unicorns. I love pink. That may be surprising to a lot of people, because a lot of people think that my favorite color is black, but it's not. It's pink. Um. So this thing, it's my favorite thing ever. Like, cause look at it, look, it's so fluffy, like, look at that rainbowness. It's adorable. Um, and it has a sparkly silver horn and sparkly silver eye. Like, look at those big eyes. Isn't it just so cute? And then look, it even has little, little, it's sparkly and, and it has a cute pink nose and, and I just, I love everything about it. And look at those wings. Aren't they shiny? So, like, if you are ever at my house or whatever, um, I've just been carrying this thing around. Like, with no exact purpose, but just to, like, stare at it. And sometimes I might just, like, my mom might be nearby, and I might be holding it, and I'd just be like, Mom, look! And then she'd look at it and she'd be like, oh, that's nice, Tawa. I love this thing. Oh yeah, guys, we had a science test yesterday. 
and I want to tell you guys about it as well because I think that I failed well I mean I know that I failed um because <laughs> we were given this workbook to do right for the test um and like I I, I was really really tired and sad and not in the mood to do anything because you see I hadn't really eaten that much that day like I mean I had my protein shake for breakfast and the school lunch was gross so I didn't want to have it well actually no that's a lie at second break because like this was like last period science right during my second break because I hadn't eaten anything I decided to get like for the school lunch, we had these samosas, butter chicken filled samosas. You're only supposed to have one of them. But I was hungry and I was sad. I was tired. I had five of them. And then I felt icky and yucky and sad and even, well, like, I felt even sadder afterwards. And I was just like, damn. It was tasty though. Um, but then I felt really groggy and icky during the science test. And my mind did not remember anything, really. Um, I did not want to read. Um, I, I, I just didn't want to do it, but I still had to do it anyways. Because I was just like, oh my god, I'm going to fail if I do But uh, I mean, I would have failed harder if I did not take the test. So I tried, okay, I tried. Um, but, like, you see some, like, I... I I couldn't be bothered reading the questions because like there was this one thing that we had to do it was like a full page of reading and then we had to do like a it was like a table and a graph that we needed to do we needed to read the table and put it into a graph I did not want to read any of the things so I just did the graph using the information from the, I tried okay I it looked cool okay but, I mean, to be honest, graphs always look cool. But for some reason, teachers always tell me that, like, like no, whenever I'm, whenever my, I, I get my test results back, they always put X's on the graphs that I draw. And they do not give an explanation to as to why my graphs are drawn incorrectly. But I swear I'm drawing them to, like, I'm drawing them, like, I'm following all the rules. I'm doing everything correctly, I think, but it still gets marked wrong. So, the entire science test, I just did that. I kind of answered the que I tried to answer them. And then the last thing we had to do was, like, like write an entire page about friction or something. I, I, I did not want to write, but I still did it because I thought, oh, this will be fun. So, I just spewed out some random sciencey words and tried to form semi-coherent paragraphs and I, th I think that it turned out pretty well I don't know I forgot but like with the science stuff I c I couldn't even read it even if I wanted to because I forgot what half of the words meant because like you know how there's always fancy science words and stuff well yeah my mind there's no room in my mind for that like why am I ever going to use use that kind of stuff and endemic and biodiversity diversity and and Mrs. Green or whatever and 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 that science stuff like I don't know that st there's no room in my mind for that my mind is already filled with like cute things like thoughts of cute I didn't even I wasn't thinking about science I was thinking about cute things like rainbow hedgehogs and and cute kin videos and and Andy beer sack like I did not want to do the science but I did it anyways and then we left and then I went home couldn't go to the gym because my mom said no so I just did some white stuff Anyways, um, stare at this thing, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get all the latest updates. Bye-bye.